Hi, I'm Ashley, Senior Clinical Advisor at Care Patron, and I'm here to help guide you through the pronated drift assessment. What is a pronated drift test or assessment? Pronated drift is a pathological sign that points towards palsy. It also emerges as a result of an upper motor lesion, which is an injury to the brain or spine that can be the result of several conditions such as cerebral palsy, stroke, traumatic brain injury, and even multiple sclerosis. It is also a sign that there is an abnormality in the corticospinal tract, which is responsible for voluntary distal movements. If this tract becomes injured or compromised in some way, muscles on the side of the body become weaker. If a person has pronated drift, there is an involuntary rotation of their forearm and palm. They will move downward if they extend their arms forward and attempt to keep them in the same position for some time. The pronated drift test requires the following. A patient who is awake and can follow directions. A chair for your patient, though this is optional because you can conduct this test with them standing up or sitting down. And a stopwatch. You will then instruct the patient to sit down or stand up depending on their level of comfort. Tell them to close their eyes and keep them closed until the test is over. Have them extend their arms forward and keep their arms facing upwards for 20 to 30 seconds. If the patient can maintain the position of their arms for the duration of the test, their motor function is intact and they are negative. If one of their arms turns inward and moves downward or drifts to the side, have your patient correct their arm positioning while keeping their eyes closed. They're already positive if the arm turns inward and drifts to the side. After this test, it's best to conduct other neurological tests to check for other possible pathological signs and problems. As a result, it's commonly used by neurologists. Here's how to use the pronated drift test. The first step is to fill in the patient information. You'll then need to gather the materials and read the instructions. Conduct the test and record the results. Remember to note whether the results are positive or negative. To view a sample assessment of the pronated drift test, head on over to carepatron.com and download and access the test for free. You can also access the test through the Care Patron platform within the community section. Type in the keywords and edit the note however you wish. Thanks for watching and remember to subscribe to Care Patron to view more healthcare videos.